so before start a discussion on the today's topic i would like to tell you please subscribe my channel so you can see on this channel up till now i have covered the project on Ra arduino project on the raspberry pi project on the python programming python programming web application and all the project details i have covered from very basics to advanced so if you want to learn the raspberry pi arduino python web application designing from me please subscribe my channel all the projects are free and i will not take any single rupees pro from you for that projects only point is you have to watch the complete video and try to execute all the project at your end from today onwards i will add the new playlist that is the peak controller peak my controller application designing so in this playlist also we will try to cover more than 50 topics so if you want to learn the embed system again from me then please subscribe my channel please support me hello friend in today's session we will learn how we can design and develop a protein simulation of IR sensor interfacing with peak mic controller so you can see on the screen we have the peak mic controller we have the IR sensor and we have the LED so in this video I will try to cover all the part that is how to design and develop this project in the protest software then we will see the importance of each and every line from the programming part also you will get my ready-made simulation at the end so please watch my complete video so that you will get idea about each and everything about this project okay before start the next part i would like to tell you what will be the final output so that you will get idea about what you will learn at the end of this video so once i run this project you can see currently the led will turn off and once i give the one signal to this ir sensor then led will turn on the one signal to this ir sensor means that the obstacle is present in front of this ir sensor this is a simulation video so for to simulate that obstacle we will use this logic logic state so if you run this project on actual hardware also it will run but the point is once we give the one signal here the led will turn on and once we give the zero signal here then led will turn off so that is the interfacing with ir sensor with peak mic controller now you can see once i give the one signal to this the led will turning on so that is the one part and once i give on zero signal to here then led will turn off so this is the complete idea behind this project now i hope you understand the project concept now we will see how to connect this hardware in the protest software and then we will see the programming part of this project now we will see the hardware connection but before start the hardware connection first of all first of all you have, you have to install the ir sensor library in your laptop so how to install that ir sensor library library i will tell you first of all you have to download my project from google drive link this one led plus ir sensor project so this pro, uh, folder i will put in my google drive link google, the google drive link given in the description of this video so go, in, go inside that folder you will find another folder that is infrared sensor library protest folder so open that folder and you will find this file so you can select these three files this three file you can select and copy right click here and copy so once you click right click copy just go to the seed then program 86 then lapse electronics then here protest 8 and then data and then library and here you, you have to just paste whatever you copied paste that file here i have already pasted my file so that it is asking me replace the destination of the file so you can skip uh, you can paste that file you can click on continue button so once the file is pasted in your lab laptop at this location then uh, infrared sensory library then infrared library get installed in your laptop now the next part what you have to do you have to watch my uh, you should watch my this video protein simulation of led blink project by using peak my controller why this project you should watch because in this project i have already explained how to connect led with peak mic controller that is the basic step so i will not explain this step again because that is already covered in my previous video so this video link also i will give in the description so i hope you watch that video and once you watch that video you will find this uh, circuit at your end now after that our point is we have to con connect the ir sensor at this position so how to connect ir sensor just go to the component mode then click on p and type here ir sensor so once you type ir sensor you can select this ir obstacle sensor and click on ok and place that sensor here so once you place the sensor next part is you should connect this three pin so first you should connect vcc pin so vcc pin you should connect to the power so just go to the terminal mode and click on power here you can see there is a power and just place that power here and after that connect that power to this power then after that ground the ground pin you should go to again terminal mode then click on ground you can see there is a ground 
and place that ground here then connect that ground to ground now next part is out pin should be connected to the peak mic control that is pin number is rb4 and how to connect that one i will tell you so first here uh, out pin just go to the again terminal mode click on default and place one default pin here i connect that default pin like this then double click on this default pin and give your name ir underscore sensor and click on ok after that test pin from this ir sensor should be connected to logic state so just go to the component mode then click on p and type here logic state so once you type logic state just select this logic state click on ok and place that logic state here then right click on this logic state rotate 180 degree now once you place the logic state here just connect that logic state like this so once you connect logic state the point is how to connect this IR sensor pin to the peak mic controller so here we have to connect that IR sensor pin to the peak mic controller that is RB4 pin so just go to the again terminal mode just click on default and place that default RB4 pin here uh, in front of RB4 then connect that pin to here and then double click here and then again give the same name IR sensor so once you give the same name logically this pin again gets connected with the this pin ir sensor so make sure that whatever the name here you you have given ir sensor with small and capital letter that should be identical with the same name here ir sensor so in this way we complete the hardware connection now the next part is we have to connect the hex uh, we have to load the hex file into this ir sensor so double click on this uh, ir sensor then go to the uh, this folder and again inside that go to my downloader folder and here you will find one library that ir sensor protest library and inside that you will find this file hex file so click on ok and click on ok here so double click here go to the folder select that hex file click on open and click on ok so in this way uh, the hex file gets loaded into ir sensor so in this way we completed the hardware connection of this project now we will see the programming part of this project now before start the program explanation i would like to tell you uh, we will use the same program that i already covered in my previous video the video name is this one how to connect switch with the pic mic controller now i will tell you reason behind that why we use the same program so basically what this ir sensor will do once you give one one or zero signal here this ir pin you can see this ir pin will send the one or zero signal on this pin of pic mic controller so ultimately it is the same working of the switch controller uh, let it, uh, ultimately ultimately it is the same working of this switch uh, because once you press the switch here then what it will do it will send the one or zero signal on this pin and this this signal gets connected to this uh, pick my controller and then pick my controller read the one or zero signal so switch working and this ir sensor working both are the same so indirectly if you use the switch program then also it will work on the IR sensor now this is the logic behind that why we why we use switch program now i will open the switch program and i will tell you how uh, how this program are equal so first of all how to open that switch program you require this mplab id software so how to install this id software in your laptop i already told my my already told my in first video the first video is led blink project so please watch that video that video link also given in the description so just open this program now op once you open this software just go to the file and click on open workspace so once you click on open workspace you will find this program from my A led from the switch this project led with switch from this project you will find this program led with switch protest project so open that project so once you open that project ready made software like ready made so uh, we can say program available for you so in this program you can see i have given here button button but we require the ir sensor so instead of button you can just change the ir sensor name here instead of button i will give ir sensor so it will be more easily uh, readable so ir sensor pin is connected to rb4 so whenever there is a button you can see it is a button here so i just replace that button with the ir sensor you can see this this is the IR sensor name. I just replace this here also. And all the program are same. 
so ultimately we can use the uh, switch led with switch program and just replace button by the ir sensor just for the user readability purpose otherwise if you don't uh, rename that also it is also okay so this is just small change we require and all the each and every line of this program i have already explained in my that in my previous video this video so please watch that video if you want to understand the program now once you have this program just go to the file and click on save as button so once you click on save as button what i will do i will save this program with ir sensor name so i have this ir sensor plus led folder i will put that program for you so if you require ir sensor program you can easily take from here so i will just click on save as button so ultimately both program are saved so we have this program we have this ir sensor program now what we can do just click on this build all button so once you click on this build all button you can see there the hex file is created so this hex file will use to run my readymade simulation so how to use my readymade simulation that we will see in 5 minute now we will see how to run the protest uh, project and how how you can use my readymade simulation so first of all you require protest 8.9 software if you are using my readymade simulation if you don't have protest 8.9 software then also you can design and develop this protest project in your protest uh, software but in that case you are not able to use my readymade simulation so if you want to do by yourself then follow the step that i already told in my previous video this video and you can design that uh, simulation from your end so if you want readymade simulation just click on this uh, protest 8.9 and click on run as administrator and click on yes button then go to the open project then go to the again downloaded folder from my google drive link so youtube then pick led plus ir sensor here you will find this led with ir sensor ir sensor protest project click on open so once you open you can see ready made simulation you that available for you so you have to just download that folder from my google drive link okay this is the first part now the second part is you have to load the hex file so double click on ir sensor click on folder and already i told you how to load this hex file in my project in my video so click on this hex file now the second part is second hex file we require from this mplab uh, project where we design ir sensor with led part so when we click on this build button you will find the hex file path here you can see this hex file path so copy this hex file path from here just go to the protest project and click on double click on the pick my controller then click on this folder paste that path here enter you can see hex file path is here and click on ok and then you can save this project and just click on this run button so once you click on this run button you can see led is blink off so when i give one signal to here led will turn on when i give zero signal to here led will turn off so this is the idea behind this project i hope you understand the complete video and hope i hope you understand the simulation part of this project also uh, if you like my content then please click on like button please subscribe my channel please support me thanks for watching this video